Hey guys, how's it going? I'm really excited to do this video because I kind of want you guys, I guess, get to know me. Kind of. So, yeah. Um, first off, I'll just give you some general information. Number one, my name is Anthony, if you don't already know that. I'm 15 years old, and if you don't know, I freaking love Marvel. Let's actually get into details, I guess. Number one. Yeah, this is the most obvious one, considering um, if you've seen my banner, if you've seen my profile picture, and if you have also seen my previous two videos, I love Marvel, as I just said earlier in this video. Um, loved it since I was born. 2002, Spider-Man came out. I would have been three years old then, okay, maybe it was when I was three. But still, that's kind of what got me to uh, love superheroes. Uh, fun fact, actually, I have three copies of the first Spider-Man film. Reason being, okay, number one, when I was like four or five, I think it was when I was four, you know, the DVD came out for the first Spider-Man movie. I kid you not, I watched it so many times, the disc actually broke. There's all scratches on it, like, and I treat, I treat my disc with care, you know, even as a three-year-old. Okay, maybe when I wasn't three, I didn't treat my disc with care. But, either way, I watched it so many times, the thing actually broke, I had to buy a new copy. And I also have another copy pretty much because I got the Blu-ray trilogy. And yeah, so the reason I love Marvel so much is because just all the characters are so amazing and they're superheroes in general, they're just awesome. They're just awesome characters, you know, they're fictional and you know, when you read the comics and when you go into the cinema and watch a movie, you know, you're really sucked into this universe of just fictional characters, and this stuff wouldn't happen in real life, and that's what's fun about it, you know? Seeing something different for once. It's just really cool, and seeing these characters, you know, and they've, they're kind of an inspiration almost, you know? It's not as, um, like, I'm not saying as in, an inspiration as in, you know, when I'm older, I'm gonna be fucking Spider-Man, and I'm gonna put web shooters on and swing around the city. I'm saying that they're kind of like, you know, I like their, their purpose. Their purpose is to give people hope, I guess, and to show people that there is hope, there is always hope, and everything will always be better, especially when they're there, and you know, in real life, yes, there aren't superheroes, okay, but it's kind of, it kind of just makes me feel as though, you know, when I do watch the movie, when I do read the comics, you know, yes, there aren't real superheroes, but it kind of makes me know more that there is still hope, you know, even through, you know, sometimes you go through dark times in life, but there will always be light at the end of the tunnel, that's very fucking cliche, but I had to kind of say it. Number two, I love collecting. It's freaking awesome, you know. Um, action figures, statues, Blu-rays, DVDs, uh, Lego sets, pops, you know, the little bobblehead Funko pops, all right? So much so, spent $300 on this freaking amazing, no pun intended, amazing Spider-Man 2 Hot Toys figure. It is awesome. Freaking awesome. Also, I love collecting pops. Thank you, Luke, for getting this for me for last year's Christmas. It's awesome. These little bubblehead things, these are Funko Pops. All right, these are dancing group. They're good because they're cheap. They're only $15 each. So, you know, who, you know, whenever I go to Northland to watch a movie, which is every few months, you know, I'll just stop by the uh, the shop there, the collectible shop or EB Games and something, and I'll get a pop because they're only $15 and they're really cheap. That's what I like. I think what I like about collecting is just the joy of it, you know, just the achievement of when you do get, you know, a whole series of figures in one series, you know, all the figures in one series, it's just really cool. Number three, I love movies. Watching them, making them, watching them being made. Amazing, alright. Uh, movies for me, I've grown up always loving movies. I think ever since I was around six or seven, I just had a passion to make movies. And I remember when I was 11 years old. When I was 11 years old, my parents bought me a flip camera for my birthday. And it was literally the best gift ever, because I always... I, it was so small and compact, and I just walked around filming, I made videos, I made videos of myself and that, you know, and I played different characters, you know, because I was only 11, you know. It was really fun, and I really have a passion for movies, and when I'm older, I really do want to get into the movie industry, hopefully be a director, if not, maybe even a screenwriter, or maybe even a concept art designer, and I really love going to the cinema, especially IMAX, like, Massive, huge screen, crystal clear image, very loud, clear speakers, really immerses you. So, that's what I love about movies. And also, the way they're designed is really cool, you know, to have them in different poses, like you, like they are in the movie, and just to have them on your desk, just sitting there. It's just really cool. 
Number four, I love playing video games, alright? I'm not a nerd when it comes to video games, okay? I don't have a lot of knowledge about all these video games and that, but I do like playing them, I do, especially Dreamwood. I play Gmod every night for like three or four hours, you know, from like nine o'clock to twelve o'clock. And I also like playing superhero games. That's really fun. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I had a really fun time shooting this video and letting you guys know a bit about me. Please leave a like, please leave a comment, please subscribe if you did enjoy this video, okay? You can also just suggest some videos that you guys want me to do in the comments and it will kind of make it easier for you guys to see what content you actually really want. Alright, that's cool. Thank you, bye. What's on a